While we are on the topic of Alexander Nevsky, I wanted to create a new video for this. It kind of got me thinking about Superman Red Sun. Hello Nathanites. My name is Nathan. Welcome to my channel. Please consider subscribing to my channel if you like content like this and leave a like for this video. That would be fantastic. What got me thinking about this was I was I watched and I reviewed a movie called Gunfight in Rio Bravo. If you'd like to see that video, it'll be posted up in the cards right there. And he did a vi and he did an interview with uh, Viking Samurai, which is another YouTube channel. Uh, Alexander is a Russian bodybuilder who came to Hollywood to become an actor, which is kind of similar to what happened with uh, Arnold Schwarzenegger. Now, if you look at this guy, if you really look at this guy. He is uh, tall and he's in incredible, incredible shape. Now considering his age, he's 51, if they decide to do a live action Superman, Red Sun, I think this guy should be at the top of the list. He, in my, in my opinion, he can really pull it off because of his size, strength, and rousing good looks that I'm jealous that he has. Not to mention that he was born in Russia. I personally believe that they, if they decided to make a movie like this and if they decided to cast him, uh, I think it would add to the authenticity of the story and the fact of and the fact of being uh, Russian. And I really can't think of anybody else who can play this character of a Russian Superman other than Scott Atkins. Even though he is English and he's 46 years old, he can pull off, he can really do an, an, an impressive Russian accent. If you watch his movies, uh, Undisputed 2, 3, and 4, he plays a uh, Russian fighter, a very intimidating <laughs> Russian fighter, as most Russians are, they sometimes can be intimidating. And if Scott, and if Scott can't, uh, does he get the role of Superman, he can definitely get the role of uh, the Russian Batman. Again, uh, considering uh, Scott's uh, size, and his background, he is a martial artist, and he does keep himself in incredible uh, shape. I think he can pull that off. I think he can pull both roles off, either one or the other. But anyway, I guess that's all I got for you guys. So uh, tell me what you guys think. And is there anybody that you can think of that could pull off a Russian Superman? And I want you to think... Someone that is not American that can pull off a uh, Russian Superman. So I think that is an add to authenticity. I think it should, it should be somebody from that area of, you know, either the Russian area or somebody who can really do a really good Russian accent. It's definitely got the looks and the shape of Superman. Definitely got to be somebody rugged, that's for sure. I mean, this is Russia after all, after all. So, yeah, tell me what you think. Tell me if you think of somebody that can uh, do that also. And tell me what you think of this video. Definitely love to know your opinion on it. And if you're a comic book lover, i definitely love to know what your opinion is on that is. Uh, but check out uh, his movie, Gunfight at Rio Bravo. It is really good. And that's all I got for you guys. So, until then, and until the next video... Live long and prosper. May the force be with you. Be excellent to each other. Party on, dudes. I'll see you guys in the net. On the bounce. On the bounce. I'll see you guys on the bounce, okay? Bouncing. Let's bounce. Yeah.